Hello everybody, it's Claire here from My Creative Spirit with a new project to share with you. This is the Millie album and case decorated in papers from the PS I Love You collection from Graphic 45. It's available as a Facebook Live class if you'd like to make it yourself and a full video driven PDF tutorial as well. You'll find the links to uh, everything for the project below. We're also having a custom made kit made so that you can um, create the project without cutting your own chipboard too. So do check out the links below. Let me take you through the project. It's a lovely deep box measuring ten and a half inches by three inches by almost eight inches tall. It's got a ribbon tie with some of the stickers on from the collection and just metal feet at the bottom and it opens to reveal a really lovely presentation album inside. So let's just pop the box to one side. It's all assembled using our signature black construction tape um, and I'll pop the link to that below for you as well. The album measures 10 inches wide by seven and a half inches tall by just over two and a half inches deep and again it's decorated with those gorgeous papers from the PS I Love You collection by Graphic 45. So we've just got a layered cover, not too deep because the album needs to fit in a box and then inside we've got a choice of pages and they're interchangeable so you can create a custom album for the pictures that you want to put in it with the various page options. So the first one has got two pockets at the top here. Let's get something I can just slide in. So two nice pockets at the top here for your photo mats and then a nice area there to put a picture on as well. The top of the page is held closed with a magnet and then there's a nice area for photos here and two more smaller areas down here and then the whole thing lifts up opens out to give you two tuck spots for more pictures and a deep pocket on the page as well i love that combination with the brown and the gold and the black and then i've just embellished with a little sticker here so that one all closes down with the magnet and then we have got a side opening page with the pocket on the front, oops, opens out. I've just put some little photo mats here so that you can see what it looks like with pictures in. And then a nice area for two larger pictures, portrait pictures here. And on this side flap, you can also put your landscape pictures. So the papers just become a background once you start to add your photos. And this album looks gorgeous with black and white pictures in. It really sets off the colours of the papers. And then flipping over, we've got a nice area on the back of the page, again, for your pictures. Then onto a pocket page. So if you've got larger photos, this is perfect to just slide them under that tuck spot but also you can place pictures on the page as well. And there's a tuck spot on the back of that page. The top of the page is closed using our signature black construction tape. And then this is a fun page. We've got a nice large photo mat area on the top here, held closed with a magnet. That opens up. Another space for a picture on the back. And then two side opening flaps, again for pictures on the front and back. But I've added pockets on the inside here so that you can tuck things into them. And then a large area in the centre for more pictures. So again, it creates a lovely layout of um, photos that you may want to pull all together. And then it just closes up and clicks with its magnet. On the back of this page I've added a lovely pocket. We all love to put things in pockets and because it's as wide as the page it will hold quite a lot. And then I've embellished it with one of the cutouts from the paper. Got another side opening page here. 
as I say, you can mix and match the pages. So if you like a particular style, you could pick six of those, that particular style to create the album. They're all the same width. So another nice area for your pictures. And then we've got a side opening page. It's held together with a paper clip. Again, room for four photographs on both sides of these fold outs. Nice area here for more pictures. Opens with a magnet. Nice deep pocket at the top there. A fold down photo mat at the bottom. And then a tuck spot for more pictures in the centre. I love that colour combination, the greens with the roses. Very pretty. And then it closes with a magnet on the main flap and a paper clip to hold those side opening flaps together. Another nice large area here. The page with the tuck spot. I've used that as an alternative page, alternate page. So I've got three of these and then the other page styles slotted in between. Again, I love that combination. Those colours are gorgeous. The last of the flat pages and then right at the back I've put a fold out page. Again, large areas for your pictures and then I've popped a pocket on the left hand side here just to hold a fold up photo mat. Embellished with cutouts from the paper. We've got a sticker on the pocket and then on the other side we've got a nice little tag using leftover paper from the main area in a little pocket. And again there's a sticker embellishment detail on there as well. And that's it. That is our mini album and case. All decorated in papers from the P.S. I Love You collection by Graphic 45. So if you love the album and you'd like to make it, or the album in the case, do check out the Facebook Live option below and join me for a couple of crafty workshops to make the project, or the PDF tutorial, and also the laser cut kit. Thanks for watching. I hope that's inspired you to get creative with this gorgeous new paper collection. And happy crafting.